Excitement over the announcement the Ford Motor Company will build a new vehicle and battery manufacturing plant in West Tennessee certainly has not worn off yet. In fact, the multi-billion dollar investment will be located on what's called the Memphis Regional Mega Site in Haywood County, creating nearly 6,000 jobs. People who live in the small town of Stanton are hoping to see their community benefit from that huge project. I'm a proud Ford owner. I've had this truck for quite a few years now before any of this even dreamed of happening, yeah. Longtime Stanton, Tennessee resident John Adams can't wait for Ford Motor Company to start construction on Blue Oval City in Haywood County. It's going to be a big shot in the arm for Stanton, for all these communities, for all the county seats around. The Memphis Regional Mega Site off Highway 222 will be home to an electric vehicle and battery manufacturing plant employing nearly 6,000 workers. Adams, who along with his wife Linda have a passion for preserving Stanton's history, says it's past time for the mega site to have a tenant like Ford. For some reason, the interest wasn't here. I, I don't know why, but you know, the mega site is a huge place, and we've got a lot of people in this area in West Tennessee, and it will benefit West Tennessee plus the state. But Adams also hopes all the benefits from the facility won't be focused on larger communities like Memphis and Shelby County. He knows to attract both construction and plant workers to Stanton, there needs to be more housing available. Most definitely. A lot of cotton fields that need some houses and other things in it. Updating Stanton's infrastructure has been a topic of conversation ever since the mega site became reality. So the only thing would have to be enlarged is our water lines and sewer lines primarily. That would be the biggest thing. Alderman Ward Smith says he and other town leaders are anxious to meet with Ford executives before construction gets underway. To explain to us exactly what is happening now, what's going to happen in the future, and can we depend on that? Production of all electric F-Series trucks and battery components is expected to begin in 2025. Oh, and speaking of new ventures, rapper and